my favorite, probably my favorite Andrew story. I wish he was here. I wonder if he would find this funny or if he wouldn't. He probably wouldn't find it funny. He probably wouldn't find it funny. Anyway, it's okay. Tell it anyway. Tell it anyway. Okay, so it was like a Sunday afternoon in Whippany, which is a lot like Sealand's Grove in that there's nothing to do on a Sunday afternoon except go to Walmart. Um, so, or that. So we were taking a drive, and it was like typical, and he's like, what do you want to do? And I'm like, I don't know. What do you want to do? He's like, I don't know, what do you wanna do? And I was like, why don't we just go back to my house? And he's like, what are we gonna do there? And I was like, well honestly, I'm probably just gonna mercilessly seduce you. And he looked at me, and like in all seriousness, like this is not a joke, this was not sarcasm, he just looked at me and went, is there anything else to do? Oh! <laughs> what the hell? Right? Okay, now my other favorite Andrew story has nothing to do with the next song, but I'm gonna tell it anyway, because it usually gets a few laughs. I really like humiliating myself in public. This is why I do these things. So anyway, but this is the first time I've been mic'd across campus, so this is pretty kick-ass. Um, <laughs> so, um, <laughs> so I had knee surgery um, in high school, and um, one of the first things I was allowed to do again was ride a bike, which is really exciting because like I was like running every day before that. And I was like, shit, now I can't do anything. But anyway, so Andrew was like, okay, why don't we go for a bike ride? I'm like, oh, that's nice. And I'm thinking, you know, we'll ride on the paved, boring streets of Whippany. It'll be good and safe. This is my first time on a bike in about a year because it's whole recovery process and so he takes me to this like gravelly rock trail <laughs> in the woods and I'm like shit I can do this because I was always trying to impress him and so here I am and wearing something that's completely not practical for bike riding but it's showing the goods and I'm just trying to ride a bike and I'm <laughs> it's bad news it's bad news um, so we're on this like rocky trail and, and about 20 minutes in I realized that my bike seat is loose and I didn't fix it because I haven't ridden it in a year you know I just assumed everything was fine and and the seat just keeps going like this like this and I'm like shit so every time it goes up I have to like kind of inch forward on it and set it back straight. <laughs> so we're like riding up these gravelly trails like bum 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 and the seat's going like this and I'm going like this and I'm trying to keep up with him and I fall off the bike once. It's like a really intense experience. And I'm like God all I want to do is go home. This is awful. And then um, at one point he's like he's like 10 feet ahead of me and we're like going up this hill and it's like bum 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 and then the seat goes straight up. We all know where this is going. <laughs> so I like lean forward to like get, like get it back down except I land right on it and I'm just like <laughs> he's like 15 feet ahead of me. He turns around. He's like, "What?" I'm like, Yay! <laughs> Anyway, so we can talk about it. I just walked around like this for about a week. Oh. Okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna play a song now. <laughs> oh no, I have to give more context. Okay, so this song is called "Take Him and Go." Yay! And it's about Andrew. Um. And, yeah. Yep. Yep. I heard this. One. It's about this Andrew and. This beautiful man named Lance, who I assume is with Andrew now, um, which is the inspiration for this song. It was hard. He's a very good-looking guy, Lance. He's he's pretty. I also have a problem where I fall in love with gay men. Like it's happened more than once. Like my only gaydar is that if I'm in love with a guy, he's probably gay. Um, anyway, I moved on from that. I found a solution. <laughs> take him and go and I usually like talk about it and it's, it's funny because it's like take him and go but it's actually really sad like I cried the whole time I wrote it, it was really pathetic Whew, tear okay so let's just take him and go Am. <laughs> I love it